Hello, welcome back. In today's video we will make a facade design like Naturali's Biodiversity Center. Architects, Noodling's Redek Architects. Location Leiden, the Netherlands. Let's assign keyboard shortcuts for fastest modeling speed. Type option and go to keyboard, and add these command in the respective place. These are the most useful command in sub demodeling. Expand front view and draw polygon. Number of side 6. Make a copy by hold down alt shift and drag the plane icon. Explode the polygons. Select these two curves and make sub D loft. Check sub D corner option. Select the curves and lock. Insert edge, shortcut that we previously assigned as Ctrl plus R, enable proportional. Select this vertex and move in X direction. Adjust vertices location by dragging using gumball icon. Type mirror and chose mirror axis, mirror both of sub D object two times. Select all of sub D object and join them, make sure to set sub D joined edges to crease. Make a copy by hold down alt and drag, scale in Y direction, zero enter. Select boundary edges by hold control shift and double click in one of edge, while the edges selected type bridge, check crease options. Select these edge loops by hold control shift and double click in one of edge. While the edges selected bevel them, shortcut control plus B, change segment to 2, Delete the center polygon and fill the hole. In patch style chose triangle fan. Select these edge and delete them. Do the same process for other side. Select these edges and crease them. Select these face loops and make main selections. Do the same process for the other face loops too. Select by using named selections, while these face selected type extrude sub D. Change bases from WCS to UVN and direction to men. Move the cursor toward or outward to this point to control the extrusion distance, or you can type specific distance. Here the extrusion is too large, so we can undo and use previous selection to extrude. Now it's fine, let's pass to the next step. Select these edge loops and delete them. Select the sub D and explode it. Now we can separate the sub D into two by exploding it. Delete other side and also delete half of the sub D's. Now apply symmetry by typing reflect command. 
their move symmetry. Select these edges, then type bridge, and select another side of the edge. Select this edge loop then create crease. Mirror it. Copy one of module for ladder use. Hide it. Join these modules, check join option to crease. Let's make other module, show select it. Move it to the center. Make sure it's aligned in side view also, so go to right side and align it by moving. Rotate 90 degree. Hold shift to snap to 90 degrees. Lock the previous modules. Change to wireframe view and align vertices. Apply symmetry. The arrow shows which side of sub to stay remain. Click flip to change. Scale each pairs of vertices in X and Y direction with a value of 0. Rotate 30 degree from the center. I can type 360 divide by 12 in command line. Relocate gumball. Align Y direction parallels to center edge and adjust vertices Remove symmetry, next mirror two times and join like in the previous process.
isolate the curve and copy like here. Show and place the modules inside the hexagon. Select all modulus and array in X direction set to 12 and Y direction set to 6 and leave the Z to the default. Select the spacing start from one corner of polygon to another like as you see here. Next step is to make these modules. Select these modulus and lock them, and delete other modulus that have similar pattern to this in this row. Unlock and isolate. Isolate the bottom modules. Use Zoom Selected to zoom the selected module. Select half of it and rotate it by 90 degrees. Now rotate the middle edge loop 45 degrees back. Follow the same process for other module. Here one side edge is creased and other side is smooth, so by adding crease here we can fix this. Isolate these two modules. Move one module to the side. Then type name selection. Select these faces and create new selections. Now undo the move geometry by pressing Ctrl plus Z. Select the newly created selection and delete them. Next join these two modules. Next follow the same process as the previous one.
hide all of them and array these newly created modules. Final step is copy these module and array on other side. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video.